Welcome to this new video. Today, I am going to show you how to set a PIN or password for our Windows account when logging in. So, to do this quickly, let's get straight to the point. First, go to the Start menu of your Windows. Right click on the desktop and go to where it says Display Settings. Once we are here, on the left side, you will see this entire menu, and we will go to where it says Accounts. In my case, I already have a session logged in here. However, if you have it logged in, it is highly recommended that you do so because, let's say, if you have OneDrive activated, everything will sync with your account. So, if you change PCs, buy a new PC, or reinstall Windows, let's say a backup is created based on the account you have. But that's just a recommendation. Then down here, to be able to enter the password or PIN, we have this option that says Login Options. We click there and it will appear here. I have the PIN assigned. As you can see, it's the Windows Hello PIN. But if you want to assign it, all you have to do is the following. First of all, I will explain a little about what appears here. You can unlock your PC, meaning that when you log in and enter your account, so that not just anyone can access it, you can do the following. First, you can use facial recognition. In my case, this is not available because I do not have a laptop or a camera that is compatible with this. If you have them, they are usually the same computers, the same Microsoft laptops that have this option. But if you don't have it, you won't be able to enable it. If you want to unlock it with facial recognition, if you don't have a suitable camera, you won't be able to. Then there is fingerprint recognition, and it's the same. This generally applies to all types of laptops. If you have this fingerprint sensor, the one that comes right on the keyboard, then you will be able to enable this feature. And there is no need for you to set up a password or anything. You can just use your fingerprint. Then there is the Windows Hello pin, which is what I have. The thing is, it already appeared enabled for me because I have it registered. But it may not appear for you. Why is that? Because there is also another option here called password that will appear just below. What happens? You first need to set your password in order to assign your PIN. So if it doesn't show up like it does for me, where it says how to assign a PIN or change a PIN, further down you will see an option that says password. Click on that password option and set a password as such. The difference is that Windows considers a password to be a higher level of security and there is a minimum security requirement for the PIN. So what happens is that you first need to have a password in order to assign the PIN. When you log in, you will be given the option to log in with a PIN or with a password. Once you assign the password, you simply click on what it says, like the security key, and it will expand to show a button that says create password or assign password. You assign it, and it should be several digits with security characters like an asterisk, a dash, or whatever you choose. Once you assign it, you go back to where it says PIN, and it will appear in this style, showing the option to assign a PIN. When you assign it, it will show up like mine, which is to change your PIN. For example, if I wanted to change my PIN, it shows my current PIN, which PIN I want to add, and if I want to include letters and symbols. When logging in, Windows gives us the option to choose either the password we assigned earlier or the PIN directly. Basically, that would be all. If you have any questions or if you encounter any problems, let me know in the comments section, and I will respond. See you next time. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.